This is the most pathetic thing on the planet. Tom Brady is the greatest quarterback to ever play the game of football. But there is one man who I believe, when it is all said and done, will be better than Tom Brady. Who is that man? If you guess Josh Allen, you're fucking wrong. Because f*** Josh Allen. That man is none other than Patrick Kermit Mahomes. Now, y'all are really going to think I'm insane for this one. But when you do the math out like I just did, it's really not all that insane to say. Patrick Mahomes is currently 27 years of age. So I'm going to be comparing Tom Brady and Patrick Mahomes. Holmes' statistics up to the age of 27, and then I'm going to average everything out to figure out how much Mahomes needs per season for the rest of his career to beat Brady's records. So let's get right into it, y'all. Starting off with their completion percentages. So Tom Brady, up to the age of 27, had 1,577 completions out of 2,548 completions for a 62% career completion percentage up to that point. That's pretty damn good. That's, that's a good completion percentage. But I know one man who are Already has beaten that Mr. Patrick Mahomes at this point in time 1,985 completions the man's already about to crack 2k before the end of these f***ing playoffs out of 2,993 passes thrown for a completion percentage of 66% so he already has Brady beat at this point in time up to age 27 just from completion percentage moving on to passing yards Tom Brady at the age of 27 18,035 passing yards that's a pretty good number but i know who beats it patrick mahomes at the age of 27 has 24,241 passing yards god damn so that's two mahomes zero brady tom brady at the age of 27 why do i keep saying that y'all know that at this point Brady has 123 passing touchdowns and 66 interceptions. I was really shocked by the amount of interceptions Brady had at this point. That's a lot. That's literally every two touchdowns you throw an interception, like if you do that math out, basically. But Mahomes just blows them out the water here at this point in time. 192 passing touchdowns with 49 interceptions. So every four touchdowns, approximately, Mahomes throws a pick. We're at three Mahomes, zero Brady. That's crazy, man. All right, now just moving on to the rushing stats. Do I even read them to you guys? Like, you know Mahomes is about to win these. This is the most pathetic thing on the planet. I don't understand how Brady is so non-mobile and non-athletic. Like, the guy eats perfectly and exercises constantly. Like, I don't understand how he can't run. I just, the dude has like the slowest 50-yard dash time in the NFL, or one of them. And he's a quarterback. How does that even make sense? But at this point in time, Brady with 333 rushing yards and three rushing touchdowns. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! A lot of threes going on. That is so pathetic. My lord. And get ready for this. Brady just got blown out the water right now. Mahomes has 1,547 rushing yards in his career up to this point with 12 rushing touchdowns. The rushing stats, it doesn't even compare. Like, that is especially the reason why I think Mahomes will be better than Brady when it's all said and done, because the guy can run. I've seen Mahomes complete passes two inches from the ground. The guy is just so athletic and mobile, he just blows Brady right out the water. So I did a little math. Use that a great high school diploma to my advantage and did a little math for you guys. So for Mahomes to break Brady's all-time records, this is what he would need to do. So Tom Brady at this moment in time, 89,214 passing yards. Damn. But Mahomes has at this point in time, 24,241 passing yards. Already at the age of 27, that's a lot of passing yards. So if you do the math out for Mahomes to beat Brady's passing yard record, he would need 64,974 passing yards to beat that record. That's a lot, which means he would need to average roughly 4,040 passing yards a year. And you may be thinking to yourselves, that's a lot of yards a year. That's hard to get every year. Agreed. But since Mahomes' second year, literally since the first year he started for the Chiefs, he has not averaged at least 4,000 passing yards. So I'm convinced he's going to beat it. And how many years would it take? About 16. He's currently 27, so if he plays till he's 45, I think he's golden. I really do. He could break it by the time he's 43. And I think he'll play that long. I really do. Now to beat Brady. Brady's passing touchdown record of 649 touchdowns. Here is what Mahomes would need to do. Mahomes currently has 192 passing touchdowns. To beat that, he would need to average 32 touchdowns per year. The lowest amount of touchdowns thrown by Mahomes in a season, other than his rookie year, because he threw like one. <laughs> that number is 26. The next lowest is 37 touchdowns. So all Mahomes needs to do is average at least 32 touchdowns per year, and it will take him 14 years to break Brady's passing 
touchdown record. Do y'all think he can do everything I just said? I think he can. But let me know what y'all think in the comments below. I'd love to read and respond to you guys like always. If you guys enjoyed this video, please remember to smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you are new because we are on the come up and we are giving away $100 to one lucky subscriber when we hit 1,000 subscribers. So do not miss that opportunity. And as always, guys, it's been Teebs. Thank y'all for watching and I'll see y'all soon.